David Budd. He's a perfectionist in his job. Clean shaven, chiselled. Pleasure to meet you, Mum. As a bodyguard, he's very together, tailored, button down collars and very thin ties. Cool, calm, collected, even though we know that inside he's not. Ex army comes with a lot of demons. He has to hold it together and he's almost strapped in to his emotions with his bomb vest. And as soon as he takes this off, he becomes a much softer character. Love you. When we see him at home, we see a very different type of person. We see a very soft, vulnerable man. But we also see him completely fall apart in that time as well. You see the stress, you see the sadness in him. There's so many other things that happens to him. He's bruised and he's cut gun wounds. Vicky he was very much based on Sarah Jessica Parker in, in Divorce. You need help. She plays a nurse, practical. It's not like she's going to think about curling her hair. I couldn't really draw any inspiration from any British politicians, sorry. We went a little bit towards the French, the European politicians. And this is one of Julia's iconic outfits that she wears a lot in the Home Office. I'm afraid I can't disclose any specifics. Glamorous, stylish, quite strong colours. When she's public speaking, she's got a darker lip. That's her kind of power thing. Hair darker, gave her a wave in it. Everything is done with perfection. <laughs> so this is Chanel, press secretary. Dresses quite inappropriately for work. And she started looking like Kardashian. I think everybody else had to rein me back a little bit about that character. This is Craddock. Great job, David. We made her very earthy and also a bit hippie. Put a little bit of redness to her hair, inspired by Diane Keaton. Samson is cold. Cool, like the ice queen. Very straight talking. Home Secretary, I don't understand why you're I saying this done. now. Black, white, grey. And she just wore it so well. She's so statuesque, you know, and beautiful.